Who in here wants to work until the day you die? Wouldn't it be nice to retire comfortably and be able to go out and do the things you may never have had the chance to do? After thoroughly researching, talking to people who currently invest, and having ambitions to be a successful inventor in the future, I now realize the importance of building a strong 401k. Due to the instability and insecure future of Social Security and other retirement plans, 401k offers a safe and reliable way to prepare for your financial future. Students in our generation should begin building a strong portfolio through a 401k program as early as possible. Today I will begin by giving you an explanation of what a 401k investment plan is. I will also cover the importance of investing at a young age, as well as some investment tips that you can apply while investing. <coughs> Let's begin by getting an understanding of what a 401k investment plan is. A 401k is a type of retirement savings plan. There are two primary types of 401k, a traditional 401k and a Roth IRA. <coughs> the difference between the two is that a traditional 401k doesn't take out taxes until you withdraw your money. A Roth IRA takes out taxes before you withdraw and therefore there is no compounded interest on your returns. The other primary difference between the two is that most traditional plans are provided through large companies. If you work for a large corporation or company, the company is able to deposit into your account automatically by taking a percentage of your income. This is different from Roth plans <coughs> because they are controlled manually or by smaller businesses. Typically, a company you work for will hire an agency, such as Fidelity, to control their savings plans of their workers. If this isn't the case, an individual can open an IRA to invest in. Some of the most popular ways to invest is through mutual funds, individual stocks, bonds, and money market funds. Now that you have a general understanding of 401k retirement plans, let's take a look at why it is important to invest for retirement. Financial stability for retirement is one, of, is one of the primary concerns in 401k investors. <clears throat> According to a survey done by Mass Mutual Retirement Services, being able to retire is the greatest concern with 37.3%, which doubles the concern of health care at 16% and job security at 14.5%. In addition to this statistic, there has been an increase of the number of employees uh, that have been investing in 401k. According to an article showing the results of Hewitt Associates survey, <coughs> the percentage of employers who are automatically enrolling employees into their retirement plan has nearly doubled from 34% to 58% in the past two years. It is good to see an increase in investors, however, the average 401k balance is still slightly low. According to the Center for Retirement Research at Boston College, the average 401k balance was $66,900. This isn't enough for someone who is looking to retire unless they plan on only for a couple of years. It is apparent that retirement planning is, is a growing concern for people. One way to help ensure a stable future is to begin investing at a young age. The people of our generation will need to be smart about investing in the future. According to All Star Advice, you should max out your 401k. They say it is most important to put as much into it as you can before any other type of retirement savings. <clears throat> The idea of maxing out your 401k means putting the maximum amount of money in it that is legally accepted. The government regulates how much money you can put into your 401k annually. I know this may not be possible in all situations, however, when you have the opportunity to put a little extra into it, you should do so. The excess money in your account will help compound more and more in the future. When should you begin to start? When you when should you uh, begin starting uh, putting money into your retirement savings? According to Fidelity.com, one can accumulate over twice as much money by the time they're in their retirement stage by starting at the age of 25 versus 35. This is true based on a savings calculator that my dad and I worked on using Microsoft Excel. <coughs> we created a model based on a sample income for those investing until the age of 50. The two different models used the same income and percentages for the same year. It turned out that the first model was started 10 years earlier and the second model is better off by the age of 50 by over $800,000. The concept of investing more money at a younger age can be supported by the idea that more money will be compounded over more years. The second model, <clears throat> the one that invested starting at 35, essentially lost 10 years of compounded investments. The statistics and models show the benefits of investing at a, at a young age, however, those who invest must be smart about it. <clears throat> Let's go over some investing tips that you guys can apply in the future. Determining a goal is one of the best ways to ensure success from your investments. According to my dad, who is a firm believer in investing in 401k, 
one should plan out their finances and take inflation into account. On average, overall prices will double over a period of 10 to 15 years. Therefore, make sure to set a goal that can account for these changes. It is better to overestimate the amount you'll need to have than how to push back retirement. Another piece of advice he shared with me is to invest accordingly to your age and progress with your retirement planning. During the prime of your career, you should take greater risks and put your money in growth investments. These growth investments are stocks that will increase as time goes on. As a person grows closer to retirement, it is smarter to invest in more conservative stocks and mutual funds. He said also to pay attention to an employer's match. A company can match what you put in your 401k by 2 to 4% of your yearly salary if you save enough to earn the full match. This statement can be backed up by the article, When Savings Increase, Be Sure to Make the Most of Your 401k. According to the article, nearly 40% of 401k investors aren't saving enough to earn full company match. This means that they may be giving up 2 to 4% of their potential salary that could be put into their retirement savings. These investing suggestions will help you strengthen your retirement savings plan and help set you up for a financially stable future. We have gained a general understanding about a couple of the most popular retirement savings programs as well as the importance of investing young and some tips for investing in the future. I hope you guys don't miss out on the opportunity to set yourself up financially for the future. And I know retirement is over twice the amount of years that we've lived away, but just look at how fast those years went by.